Hello guys, welcome back to Actisite Realistic Challenge number 14 Youpert's Internet Solution Take the challenge and our scope is to break in into the system and get admin privileges Just look at some page, uh, browse the site just to understand what kind of technology are they using. Uh, CGI news dot CGI and story equal one. So I'll try to manipulate this parameter, for example. Okay, nothing. Let's try something more around the site mail we should be logged in but we don't have it for now mm. okay let's go back to news and try to manipulate more the um, story parameter as you if you use dot you got back failed to fail it to load dot dot news so there is something wrong F in this case we got failed to load dot one two three so they are trying to open a file which is dot news at the end so we can try one dot news as as you can see there is a real file inside the system so it could be a local file inclusion issue we can use percent zero zero which is the null uh, character and we're go we, we will get back the full list of the file inside the current directory as we as we did in the previously challenge with ls so we got administrator.cgi and moderator.cgi which are the most interesting pages uh, inside so let's try to open administrator.cgi inside the web browser but okay administrator.cgi nothing much 404 mm. moderator.cgi and we got some id something to input here Let's try something just to be to, to see. Action login ID one two three. Hmm. Empty, but no, it's not valid. AAA not valid. So we need to figure it out what's inside that CGI file. We can, for example, use the local file inclusion to read those files so instead of open one dot news for example we can open moderator dot cgi percent zero zero just to see if it loads or not but it should be okay let's try first administrator dot cgi and uh, yes we can read what's inside the file so if the username and password are correct, uh, we're going to be administrator by using is admin function, is admin value. And now let's open moderator.cgi. Oh, yeah, well, let's try first to open something else uh, we, we found inside administrator.cgi. But we, sh we can't use this, we can go to other folder or something like this but we try at least mm, nothing much here actually so moderator.cgi and we can see the content of moderator.cgi let's figure it out what it's asking us why is the ID so important and what ID can we use Okay, we, we can try with is admin string. Let's 
going to let me check yeah um, I think we can try it with that one is admin so let's go back is admin and login and yes we are inside the moderator panel what we can do inside this we can view account information test we don't know any information the user doesn't exist but we're going to manipulate it just to see if we get back some error um, percent uh, it's it means all percent 25 means percent we can try to use the star yeah that's the one uh, with the star we get back uh, all the information of the user inside so we got username and we got a clear text password which is really really long and we can use it inside administrator dot well actually we can try to log in first so we're going to log in with that credential web guy has username and that really long password in the password and now we are logged in and we got access to the administrator panel that's great okay so we are now allowed to open the administrator.cgi and just to check going back to the main site and see if we passed it and yes we passed it we got solved realistic challenge number 14 <laughs> Thank you.